No, wait. New room, new seats. Oh, yeah? New yeah. seats. You hooligan. If I had my way, you'd be too sort of sit down in that new classroom. Here, you can carry these. Right. Then we can stop working about the school. Then we thought it'd be so busy in the classroom. Yeah. Well, I almost got the best seat. He was here first. Don't think he could sleep. So, more the merrier, isn't it? I'm sticking out for Kendall, you nerd. Oh, this is all right. It's a bit like a hamster cage. Look who's here. Watch it, Danny. You turned up then. What's wrong? Probably fell asleep. Forgot to go home. Does it matter so long as he's here? I suppose not. Now all we've got to do is get the boys web back and we'll have a full house. We hit the jackpot, didn't we? Got everyone in all right, Tim? Yeah. Who says Bonds is furious about telling them what to do? Yeah, but can we keep it up? I mean, it's all right being called the editors and what we say goes, but it's still making us change that article before we sell any more. Well, we've got to get tough or the campaign won't work. I've got a new anti-smoking poster. No but cigarettes kill. Let's put it up in here. Not on the nice, clean walls. Hey, girls, are you a secret smoker or what? Of course not, but why put people's backs up? You'll spoil the wall. And anyway, more people are sitting in a corridor. Yeah, I've got some drawing paint if you want some. Thanks. Well, at least use blue tack. Come on, a couple of pins aren't going to hurt. If they go in. Oh, look, you chipped the wall. Now you're going to have to make it stay up or someone will see the holes. Give us the old deal. Go on, wreck the joint. We're only putting this up. How long have you been in this classroom? Ten minutes. And already it is spoiled. That's an exaggeration. You know, like that poster, no but cigarettes kill. Well, they do. And so do caretakers. Especially when they find yubbos like you abusing their new classrooms. Yeah, Mr. Griffiths, we'll be around to see you later about stopping. What on earth is going on here? I am being threatened. Get down. Come round to see me, indeed. First I find these two defacing the wall, and now I'm being threatened. Oh, threatening to save his life by stopping him smoking. So. It has started already, has it? What? I warned Mrs. McCluskey that magazine was the thin end of the wedge. You two, see Mr. Baxter break, and no buts. Like the poster says. That is enough! Oh, Danny. You have been home, I hope. Of course. Good. Well, at least you managed to find some space amongst all the books. Morning, miss. Ah, Janet. Now, I want a serious word with you. Yes, miss, smoking. I want to sponsor you to stop. You know it makes sense. All right, Janet. You stop filling my art room full of books, and I'll stop smoking. Really, Mr Baxter? And only help because I'd made such a mess of the wall. Oh, I'm thumping two more pins into it. No, I'm sorry, I don't see that. Go on. Don't let me see you in here again. No, Mr. Baxter. And you? I want you back here tomorrow break to see me and Mr. Bronson. I'm not happy with you, lad. Go on. I want Anthony. You will be at practice tonight, won't you? Oh, so you've just given me detention. Exactly. You see how difficult you're making things. I'm sorry. It's my fault for going over the top about smoking. No, it's all right. It's Bronson. He has to look at me. More trouble. Oh, Faye. Faye, can I have a word? Yeah. What do you want? Well, it's personal. Look, if it's about Cheryl Webb, I don't know nothing new. No, it's about your smoking. I don't smoke. I saw you. I don't smoke. Well, then Mr King does. Mr King? I can't think you've ever have a word with him about it. I never thought it'd be that bad. People spying on people. It was this about Mr. King. Nothing. Shh. Shh. It's okay. We've got them red-handed. All right. Afraid. I don't understand it. You think we'd at least get Danny Kendall and his mom? I don't know why we're going smoking patrol if we ain't going to catch no one.
give him up that quick. He's hard to stop smoking. Search me, but we always knew where I lost smoke, didn't we? Most of all, found new places to hide. All I'm saying is don't get carried away. And next time, check the copy before it's printed. Yes, Mrs. McCluskey. I thought you'd be pleased with the way the anti-smoking campaign was going. Between you and me, I'm absolutely delighted. But I can't let my older staff think I condone pupils snooping on teachers now, can I? You're supposed to show the children how to be more subtle. Hi, sir. I'll do, darling. Yeah. What's this? My entry for the logo competition. Great. See, Anthony. Entry's rolling in. Sir. Well done. You haven't seen it yet. No, I meant well done for doing an entry. Meaning it's not like me to bother. Yeah, top. George, I think he's out to get me. He imagines things. So what was your detention for? Sticking drawing pins in the new classroom wall. See? His staff keep rubbing him up the wrong way. Well, I thought you'd understand. Help me. How? If it goes on like this, I'm really going to be in trouble. I think I might even throw me out. I won't. Keep your arms folded or something. It doesn't miss about. Keep quiet, you've got to. Yeah, but I've got to go and see Baxter again tomorrow and Bronson's going to be there. Well, that's not fair. You've already done detention. Yeah, well, Baxter wasn't satisfied and because I've seen him so often, he says we've got to sort it out once and for all. Oh, well. I'm sorry. Well, this little session isn't getting us very far. We are not in it, Miss. No, Roland. But your feet are. Clear it up, will you? Honestly, N5, you're worse than the first years. And where's Samuel today? I thought he was going to be here. Got things on his mind, Miss. Oh, so he does have one. Now listen. The whole point about the design for a book jacket is to reflect the theme of your chosen book. Now, Kevin is your book about Arsenal. Well, no, miss, but this is more interesting. The two are supposed to match up. She's in a bad mood. She's giving up smoking, is she? Here, yeah, miss, then why did I say never judge a book by its cover? Yes, Stephen, because too many people like Kevin here get into book design. I'm sorry, I haven't got time to talk about it now. Just get on with your work. Any more entries now for the logo competition are to go to Mr King. Roland, is that the best you can do? I prefer her the way she was. It's only temporary. A week or two. Once the craving for nicotine's gone, she'll be back to her usual self. Twice as fit. Miss. Danny, aren't you supposed to be in a class somewhere? Amy's put this in the competition. All entries are to go to Mr. King. Amy McCluskey? Who's he? Me. Don't tell no one. I ain't gonna get nowhere with Danny Kendall, am I? Oh, right. <laughs> Will you all please keep quiet and get on with your work? Hard, isn't it? What? Teaching? Nah, giving up smoking. Here, some gum. Special. Helps. <laughs>